Okay guys, today we're going to be making a video about Stronghold or SHX. Today the price is sitting about at about two tenths of a penny. Or sorry, no. Uh, that's one fifth of a penny. Even better. Okay, so there's a couple different ways you can buy SHX. It's not on many exchanges right now. Uh, if we go down here and look, we can see that it's on BitTrue. They have a pairing. So you can either send in USDT. Don't do Ethereum. Send it in via uh, Tron. It's pretty cheap. But actually the best thing to do is send in, say, XRP or XLM. Sell that for USDT on the exchange and then buy the SHX that way. So, um, But you can also see it's on their native DEX. Uh, the stellar term here so that's what we're going to be doing today is uh, buying over at stellar term so go over to stellar term and we're going to log in with ledger and then it's just going to connect with the ledger you want to make sure you have the uh, stellar app open on the ledger it says use wallet to view accounts then you know you're ready connect with ledger accept the terms and then and then log in Log in with the ledger. So um, let's see. Okay. Now, in my one of my previous uh, videos, it's called storing uh, SHX. I'll put the link in the description below. You have to have the the trust line set up already um, to be able to uh, buy this and have it uh, go in there. So then we'll go over here to the exchange. Um, okay, we'll, we'll pair it with XLM. So as long as you have XLM in the account, you should be able to buy this. And then we'll find a stronghold, SHX right here. So we'll go down, you can see there's the chart right now. It's about 0 0.015 uh, XLM per stronghold. So uh, here's the sell side of the order book. Here's the buy side. Um, let's see, the bottom uh, sell is 0 0.015019, and we see that right here. It's already in there. So we're just going to buy 100, we'll buy 1,000 SHX for this video. And then you can hit buy and then sign the transaction. And then uh, it should get it as long as it's a little bit lower on the sell side. But what I've noticed is sometimes you got to, uh, say, add just like a, another number, like a 9-9. Nine, nine. You know, this, this way we know it's higher and get it for sure. So then we just click buy. Sends the transaction to be signed to your hardware wallet. So you just right click to finalize transaction and double click and then and then there we go it's uh oh, okay so if we oh it put it oh no it went through it went through yeah so we're good we're good now if it if it hadn't gone through or if you wanted to try and say put a little bit lower of an order so we'll go here you can say I I don't want to pay 0.015 but if you give it to me for 0.014 I'll take it so and then you can put in the thousand right there so and then this is going to put you on the limit buy side so you have to wait for somebody to sell you that and uh, at this point to get down to 014 it looks right around 6600 XLM's worth of now 6100 XLM's worth of SHX. So we hit buy. Oh, we have 1000, 014, that's right, buy. And then we'll go through and sign the transaction. Now this one will not go through right away, I'll show you. So you can see, oh, what the? Somebody, what the? Bot. Huh. That should 
not have gone through. Oh, okay. Sorry, guys. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Eesh, we got, uh... <laughs> Oh man, I put the thousand where the price goes. Oops, well, no, no wonder it went through. <laughs> it's, it's not even at 0.015, we put a thousand as the price. All right, so the price we're gonna put is 0 0.014, and then we want a thousand SHX. Um, okay, we'll hit buy again, and then we go all the way down here, finalize transaction, it's sending it. This one should not go through, it's definitely not that low. And. Uh, you can see our order. There it is for 14 XLM. We want a thousand, and it's on the limit buy side now. And until that gets sold down to, uh, the order won't get hit. And if you go a little lower here, you can see that there it is. So uh, you can leave it to sit there. You can cancel it. You can put it lower. You can just put it higher. Whatever you want to do. But there it is. If you want to cancel it? Just hit the X right here. Then sign the transaction on the ledger. So that's uh, so. <laughs> if, you, if you put a higher price on the uh, than the actual, it is. It's like a market buy almost. But it looks there's a lot of liquidity, so we're just slam it into this. So you can see there's three million SHX. There's another three million SHX. There's a lot of SHX liquidity right now. 112,000. Up to 0 0.01509, and we can figure the price out what that is in USDT. So to do that, we'll just take our calculator, and we'll put 0 0.01509. And you multiply it by the price of XLM down here, and then so uh, 1334. So it's at right around 0 0.002. They're selling a bunch of 0 0.002. So then if we find SHX on BitTrue, um, it's actually a little bit cheaper on BitTrue right now at 0 0.001920. So if you were to buy it from there, it's not too much cheaper. But yeah, definitely a little bit cheaper on BitTrue. But that's how you figure out price. And that's how you buy SHX on the DEX. All right, guys. Uh, if you got any questions, leave them in the comments below. Like, subscribe. We'll see you later.